the whole earth is just freezing. Like I said, this deep rabbit hole on ice ages. Deep rabbit hole. Elon Musk just revealed something terrifying in Alaska. But what exactly is unfolding in the Alaskan wilderness? From hidden paradises to ancient civilizations and erupting supervolcanoes, the truth is stranger than fiction. Join us as we explore this incredible story, uncovering the secrets that the media and government have kept hidden from the public. For years, various theories and hints suggested that something extraordinary lay hidden in Alaska. Some claimed there was a land so remote and pristine that it had escaped the touch of modern society. Others believed that an ancient society was frozen beneath the icy expanse, preserved in time, waiting to be discovered. These tales, while captivating, remained unverified and largely ignored by mainstream media. However, recent revelations by scientists have brought this mystery to light. A team of researchers led by prominent geophysicists has confirmed the existence of this hidden territory. Using advanced satellite imagery and ground-penetrating radar, they have uncovered evidence of an area that has remained isolated for centuries. This discovery is set to change our understanding of Alaska and its history. The implications of this revelation are incredible. If an ancient civilization is indeed frozen beneath the ice, it could provide invaluable insights into the past. Such a find could rival other significant archaeological discoveries, offering a glimpse into the lives and culture of a long-lost people. The existence of an untouched paradise raises questions about how this land has remained hidden for so long and what secrets it may hold. The government's role in keeping this information under wraps has sparked controversy. Some speculate that the authorities, in collaboration with the media, have intentionally obscured the truth to prevent public panic or to protect this pristine area from exploitation. The reasons behind this secrecy are unclear, but the recent scientific findings have made it impossible to ignore the reality of this hidden paradise. Have you ever wondered what happens when a seemingly dormant volcano suddenly awakens? Another terrifying event in Alaska is the eruption of the Great Sitkin Volcano. This unexpected eruption has sent shockwaves through the scientific community, as it was believed to be relatively dormant. The eruption was no ordinary event. It unleashed a massive ash cloud that soared to an astonishing 15,000 feet above sea level. The U.S. Geological Survey quickly issued a red warning, alerting the surrounding areas to the imminent danger. Alaska is no stranger to volcanic eruptions and earthquakes. Its history is dotted with significant seismic activities that have shaped its rugged landscape. The Great Sitkin Volcano, located in the Aleutian Islands, had its last major eruption in the mid-1970s. Since then, it has been relatively quiet, with only minor eruptions releasing small amounts of steam and ash intermittently. This recent eruption, however, was of a different magnitude. The sheer scale of the explosion and the resulting ash cloud has raised many eyebrows in the scientific community. The ash quickly blanketed nearby areas, making the environment hazardous and unsuitable for habitation. The speed and intensity of the eruption left little time for preparation, underscoring the unpredictable nature of volcanic activity. What is the historical significance of the eruption? The Aleutian Islands are part of the Pacific Ring of Fire, a region known for its frequent earthquakes and volcanic eruptions. Over the past two centuries, three quarters of all volcanic eruptions in North America have occurred in this region. The Great Sitkin Volcano's latest eruption adds to this rich history, providing scientists with new data to study and understand volcanic behavior better. In the mid-1970s, the last major eruption of the Great Sitkin Volcano was heard as far as 30 miles away. It caused a massive seismic vibration, alerting both humans and animals to the potential danger. Since then, the volcano has been under close observation, with scientists monitoring its activity daily. The minor eruptions and constant seismic activity have earned the region a daily orange alert from the U.S. Geological Survey. 
The recent major eruption, however, has brought the Great Sitkin Volcano back into the spotlight. Scientists are now faced with the challenge of understanding what triggered this sudden outburst. The new data gathered from this event will likely reshape our geological understanding of Alaska. By studying the ash composition, eruption patterns and seismic activity, researchers hope to gain insights into the underlying mechanisms driving these powerful geological forces. But what caused this unexpected eruption? Scientists have revealed that the Great Sitkin Volcano in Alaska is powered by two magma chambers. This finding has shed new light on the continuous volcanic activity observed in the region. The new research, utilizing advanced imaging techniques, has uncovered these dual magma chambers beneath the surface, explaining the persistent seismic activity and frequent minor eruptions. The presence of two magma chambers beneath the Great Sitkin Volcano is a significant revelation. These chambers are located at different depths and interact with each other, creating a complex system that fuels the volcano's activity. The upper chamber, closer to the surface, periodically receives magma from the deeper chamber. This interaction between the two chambers leads to increased pressure and eventual volcanic eruptions. How can these magma chambers be used to predict volcanic activity? The research team used seismic data and ground-penetrating radar to map the structure of the chambers. They found that the movement of magma between these chambers causes the ground to shake, leading to minor earthquakes frequently recorded in the area. This movement also contributes to the periodic release of steam and ash, which has been observed for decades. The discovery of these dual magma chambers has significant implications for future volcanic activity. Knowing the structure and behavior of the magma system can help scientists better predict when and how eruptions might occur. This knowledge is vital for issuing timely warnings and preparing local communities for potential disasters. By understanding the dynamics of the magma chambers, scientists can develop more accurate models to forecast volcanic eruptions. These models can predict the likelihood of an eruption based on the pressure buildup within the chambers and the seismic activity detected. This predictive capability is essential for mitigating the risks associated with living near an active volcano. The broader scientific community has also taken note of this discovery. It highlights the importance of continuous research and monitoring of volcanic systems worldwide. The insights gained from the Great Sitkin Volcano can be applied to other volcanoes with similar characteristics, improving our overall understanding of volcanic processes. What other fascinating discoveries have been made in Alaska? Researchers from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration came across an eerie glass squid deep in the waters around Alaska's Aleutian Islands. This discovery was made at a depth of 2,300 feet, where the conditions are harsh and visibility is low. The glass squid, scientifically known as Tuthawenia pellucida, is a remarkable creature that seems almost otherworldly. The eerie glass squid has several unique features that make it stand out. One of the most striking characteristics is its transparency. The squid's body is almost entirely see-through, allowing researchers to see its internal organs and the contents of its stomach. This transparency is a survival adaptation, helping the squid avoid predators by blending into its surroundings. Another notable feature of the glass squid is its demonic red eyes. These eyes are large and menacing, providing the squid with excellent vision in the dark depths of the ocean. The red color of the eyes adds to the squid's eerie appearance, making it seem like a creature from a science fiction movie. This adaptation helps the squid detect faint light and movement, which is crucial for hunting prey and avoiding danger in its deep sea habitat.
The discovery of the glass squid has provided scientists with valuable insights into the diversity of life in the deep ocean. It highlights the adaptability of marine creatures to extreme environments and the complex ecosystems that exist beneath the ocean's surface. The eerie glass squid is just one of many mysterious and fascinating organisms that call the deep sea home, and its discovery opens the door to further exploration and understanding of these remote areas. But the ocean isn't the only place where creatures showcase remarkable adaptability. The Alaskan wood frog, a small amphibian that exhibits extraordinary resilience in the face of harsh winter conditions. Unlike many animals that hibernate or migrate to avoid the cold, the Alaskan wood frog has developed a unique survival mechanism. It freezes solid during the winter. As temperatures drop to bone-chilling lows, the wood frog's bodily processes come to a halt. The frog's heart stops beating and it ceases to breathe. Remarkably, the frog can survive in this frozen state for months with up to 60% of its body water turning into ice. This extraordinary ability is made possible by the presence of cryoprotectants, such as glucose and urea, in the frog's tissues. These substances prevent the frog's cells from freezing solid and protect them from damage caused by the cold. When spring arrives and temperatures begin to rise, the wood frog thaws and comes back to life. Its heart starts beating again, and it resumes breathing and normal bodily functions. This process is almost magical, as the frog transitions from a frozen, seemingly lifeless state to an active and healthy amphibian. The scientific significance of the Alaskan wood frog's survival mechanism is incredible. Studying how these frogs manage to survive such extreme conditions provides valuable insights into the biological processes that enable organisms to adapt to their environments. Researchers are particularly interested in the potential applications of this knowledge in fields such as medicine and cryopreservation. Understanding how the wood frog prevents ice damage to its cells could lead to advances in preserving human tissues and organs at low temperatures, potentially improving organ transplantation and long-term storage of biological samples. Additionally, this knowledge could inform strategies for protecting other species from the effects of climate change, as extreme weather events become more frequent and severe. As we look to the skies, the bald eagle is another majestic species in Alaska. With over 30,000 bald eagles calling Alaska home, this state boasts the largest population of these iconic birds in the United States. Their presence is a testament to the region's rich biodiversity and thriving ecosystems. However, living in close proximity to these majestic creatures presents unique challenges for the residents of Alaska, especially during the nesting season. Bald eagles are not only a symbol of freedom and strength, but also an essential part of Alaska's natural heritage. These birds of prey can be seen perched on treetops, scanning the waters for fish, their primary food source. Their impressive wingspan and striking appearance make them a captivating sight for both locals and visitors. The high concentration of bald eagles can lead to conflicts with human activities. During the nesting season, which typically spans from March to July, bald eagles become particularly territorial and protective of their nests. Residents living near nesting sites must be cautious, as approaching too closely can provoke aggressive behavior from the eagles. These birds have been known to swoop down on perceived threats, using their sharp talons to defend their territory. This protective behavior, while a natural instinct, can pose risks to humans. There have been instances where people have been injured by bald eagles while unknowingly encroaching on nesting areas. Additionally, the presence of bald eagles near fishing ports, such as Dutch Harbor, leads to frequent encounters between eagles and fishermen. The eagles often scavenge for scraps, creating a unique dynamic between humans 
and wildlife. Despite these challenges, the residents of Alaska have learned to coexist with the bald eagles. Many communities take pride in these birds, recognizing their importance to the local ecosystem and culture. Efforts are made to protect nesting sites and ensure the eagles have a safe habitat in which to thrive. Educational programs also help raise awareness about the behaviors and needs of bald eagles, fostering a respectful coexistence between humans and these majestic birds. Alaska's wonders don't stop with its wildlife. The state is also renowned for another natural wonder, the Aurora Borealis, or Northern Lights. This mesmerizing light display is a result of charged particles from the sun interacting with the Earth's magnetic field. When these particles collide with gases in the Earth's atmosphere, they emit vibrant colors that light up the night sky in spectacular patterns. The scientific basis of the Aurora Borealis involves solar wind, a stream of charged particles released by the sun. As these particles reach Earth, they are guided by the planet's magnetic field towards the polar regions. Here, they interact with oxygen and nitrogen in the atmosphere, producing a breathtaking array of colors from vivid greens to deep purples. While the scientific explanation is fascinating, the Northern Lights hold a deeper cultural and spiritual significance for indigenous Alaskan communities, such as the Inuit and Athabascan peoples. To these communities, the Aurora Borealis is more than just a natural phenomenon. It is a connection to their ancestors and the spirit world. Many Inuit and Athabascan people believe that the Northern Lights are the spirits of their ancestors who communicate with the living. The lights are seen as a bridge between the physical world and the spiritual realm, offering guidance, protection, and messages from those who have passed on. This belief imbues the Aurora Borealis with a sacred quality, turning each display into a meaningful event. During the long, dark winters, the Northern Lights provide not only physical light, but also spiritual illumination for these communities. The dance of the lights across the sky is a reminder of the enduring presence of their ancestors and the interconnectedness of all life. This cultural reverence for the Aurora Borealis underscores the deep relationship between the people of Alaska and the natural world around them. But have you ever heard of the disappearing Alaskan lake? In the heart of Alaska's Tongass National Forest lies Mystery Lake, a body of water with an unusual and captivating behavior. Periodically, this lake vanishes without a trace leaving behind a vibrant carpet of wildflowers. This phenomenon has puzzled both scientists and locals, leading to a mixture of scientific investigations and intriguing local myths. Mystery Lake's disappearance is a fascinating natural event. At certain times, the lake, which seems like any other body of water, suddenly drains away, exposing its bed. Almost as quickly, the area becomes a lush field of wildflowers, creating a striking contrast to the usual watery landscape. This cycle of vanishing and reappearing has sparked numerous theories and stories. Scientists attribute this mysterious disappearance to the presence of a sinkhole beneath the lake. A sinkhole can act like a natural drain, periodically allowing water to escape into underground channels. When conditions change, such as shifts in the water table or blockages in the channels, the lake refills, resuming its usual appearance. This scientific explanation provides a logical understanding of the phenomenon, though it doesn't diminish the wonder it inspires. Local myths, however, add a layer of mystique to Mystery Lake. According to some stories, the lake is enchanted, disappearing to reveal a portal to another world inhabited by mystical beings. These tales speak of ghostly visitors and magical creatures that come to life when the lake vanishes, suggesting a deeper spiritual significance to the event. 
While these legends may not have a basis in scientific fact, they contribute to the lake's enchanting allure and cultural richness. Another area in Alaska shrouded in mystery is the so-called Alaskan Bermuda Triangle. Spanning from the Yukon River to the frozen Bering Sea, this region has gained a notorious reputation for strange and unexplained disappearances. Planes, ships, and even experienced outdoorsmen have vanished without a trace within this remote and rugged area. The Alaskan Bermuda Triangle has become a focal point for eerie stories and speculations. Many believe that there are magnetic anomalies in the region that interfere with navigation instruments, causing planes and ships to go off course and disappear. These anomalies could be caused by the vast mineral deposits and geological formations in the area, which might create unusual magnetic fields. Eerie stories from the Alaskan Bermuda Triangle abound. People have reported seeing strange lights in the sky, experiencing sudden and extreme changes in weather, and encountering inexplicable phenomena that defy logical explanations. These tales contribute to the area's mystique, making it a subject of fascination and fear. Despite scientific attempts to explain the disappearances, the Alaskan Bermuda Triangle remains an enigma. The harsh and unpredictable weather, combined with the challenging terrain, certainly plays a role in the dangers of the region. However, the exact reasons behind the many vanishings are still unclear, leaving room for speculation and myth. What is the greatest unsolved mystery in Alaska? The story of the whaling ship Octavius has fascinated and puzzled many for centuries. The Octavius set sail in 1761, aiming to complete a prosperous whaling expedition. However, the ship vanished without a trace, only to be discovered decades later in a hauntingly preserved state. In 1775, a whaling ship named the Herald stumbled upon the Octavius, drifting aimlessly among the Arctic ice flows. The sight that greeted the crew of the Herald was both eerie and unforgettable. The Octavius appeared frozen in time, with its crew members perfectly preserved as if they had only just perished. The captain was found sitting at his desk, pen in hand, seemingly in the middle of writing his log. The rest of the crew were similarly found in their positions, eerily lifelike despite being dead for years. Theories about how the Octavius and its crew remained so well preserved in the harsh Arctic conditions abound. One scientific explanation is the extremely cold temperatures which acted as a natural freezer preventing the bodies from decomposing. The freezing process could have halted all biological activity, preserving the crew in a state of suspended animation. Additionally, the lack of bacteria and other decomposing agents in such cold environments might have contributed to the preservation. However, the scientific angle is only part of the story. Local legends and supernatural explanations add a layer of intrigue and mystery to the tale of Octavius. According to some stories, the ship was cursed, doomed to sail the Arctic seas forever with its ghostly crew. This idea of a cursed ship is deeply rooted in maritime folklore, where ghost ships are often seen as omens or vessels of misfortune. Some locals believe that Octavius encountered supernatural forces in the Arctic, possibly angering spirits or entering a forbidden realm. These tales suggest that the crew may have been punished for their trespasses and condemned to an eternal, frozen voyage. Sightings of the ghostly Octavius drifting through the Arctic mists have been reported over the years, adding to the ship's legendary status. Speculative angles further fuel the mystery. Some theories propose that Octavius stumbled upon an unknown natural phenomenon that preserved it and its crew. Perhaps it was trapped in a pocket of exceptionally cold air or a unique atmospheric condition that kept it in a state of preservation. These speculative ideas, while less grounded in scientific fact, offer tantalizing possibilities that keep the mystery alive.
What has been the impact of climate change on Alaska? In the heart of Alaska, the effects of climate change are becoming increasingly evident. Rising temperatures and melting permafrost are creating significant challenges for Alaskan communities. These changes are not only altering the landscape, but also posing serious threats to the stability and sustainability of villages throughout the region. As temperatures continue to rise, the once solid permafrost, a layer of permanently frozen ground, is beginning to thaw. This thawing has dramatic consequences for the infrastructure and daily lives of Alaskan residents. Buildings, roads and pipelines, which were constructed on what was assumed to be stable ground, are now at risk as the permafrost melts and shifts. This causes the ground to sink and become unstable, leading to cracks in foundations and uneven surfaces. What other issues is climate change causing? The rising temperatures result in the loss of sea ice, which traditionally acts as a barrier protecting the coastline from powerful storm surges. Without this ice, the coastline becomes vulnerable to the relentless pounding of waves, leading to significant erosion. Villages that once sat safely above sea level are now at risk of flooding and even being swallowed by the encroaching waters. The practical challenges faced by Alaskan communities are immense. Homes and critical infrastructure are literally sinking into the ground, and the cost of repairing and reinforcing these structures is substantial. In some cases, entire villages are being forced to consider relocation to safer areas, a process that is both logistically challenging and emotionally taxing for the residents who have deep ties to their ancestral lands. Despite these daunting challenges, Alaskan communities are demonstrating remarkable resilience. Residents, engineers and scientists are working together to develop innovative solutions to mitigate the effects of climate change. Adaptation strategies are being implemented to protect infrastructure and ensure the safety of the communities. One such effort involves the development of building techniques that can better withstand unstable ground. Engineers are designing structures with adjustable foundations that can be modified as the ground shifts. These innovations are crucial for maintaining the integrity of buildings and reducing the costs associated with constant repairs. Additionally, there are ongoing projects aimed at preventing coastal erosion. Sea walls and other protective barriers are being constructed to shield vulnerable coastlines from the impact of waves and storm surges. These efforts are critical in safeguarding not only homes, but also the cultural and historical sites that are integral to the identity of these communities. Scientific research plays an important role in understanding and addressing the changes occurring in Alaska. Scientists are studying the patterns and rates of permafrost thaw and coastal erosion to develop predictive models. These models help communities prepare for future changes and plan appropriate adaptation measures. Moreover, the knowledge gained from these studies has broader implications for global climate change awareness, highlighting the urgent need for action to mitigate the impacts of a warming planet. But who is the Alaskan Bigfoot? The Alaskan Hayman is often described as a large, hairy humanoid, standing over seven feet tall with broad shoulders and an imposing presence. Witnesses claim that the creature has long, shaggy hair covering its entire body, and it moves with uncanny agility despite its size. The legend of the Hayman is deeply rooted in the oral traditions of indigenous Alaskan tribes, who have recounted sightings and encounters for centuries. Many stories describe the Hayman as a solitary creature, rarely seen, but always leaving an impact on those who encounter it. Some tales speak of eerie howls echoing through the night, attributed to the Hayman's call. Others recount sightings of enormous footprints in the snow, far larger than those of any known animal. These footprints often lead deeper into the wilderness, disappearing into areas that remain unexplored by humans. One of the most famous accounts of the Hayman 
comes from a group of hunters who claimed to have seen the creature near their campsite. According to their story, the hay man watched them from a distance, its eyes glowing in the dim light. The hunters, paralyzed by fear, described the creature as exuding a sense of both curiosity and menace. Such encounters, whether true or imagined, have cemented the hay man's place in Alaskan lore.